once stripped of its common romanticism the physical world is a foreign strange silent cold and inhuman place true knowledge is impossible and rationality and science cannot explain the world their stories ultimately end in meaningless abstractions in metaphors universe seems purposeless meaningless chaotic and irrational life has no intrinsic meaning or value with respect to the universe a single human or even the entire human species is insignificant and without any purpose when one considers the short span of his life absorbed into a preceding and subsequent eternity the small space which he fills and even can see swallowed up in the infinite immensity of spaces of which he knows nothing and which knows nothing of him there are moments when individuals question whether their lives have meaning purpose or value and are negatively impacted by the contemplation it may be commonly but not necessarily tied to the depression or inevitably negative speculations on purpose in life for example if one day i will be forgotten what is the point of all of my work this crisis may often be provoked by a significant event in the person's life psychological trauma marriage separation major loss the death of a loved one a life threatening experience a new love partner psychoactive drug use adult children leaving home reaching a personally significant age turning 18 turning 40 etc usually it provokes the sufferer's introspection about personal mortality we build our life on the hope for tomorrow yet tomorrow brings us closer to death and are the ultimate enemy people live their lives as if they were not aware of the certainty of death how we come to terms with the social world human beings like to insist that there are reasons why things happen the death of a child the crash of an airplane or a random shooting must be explained in terms of workings of a hidden plan the social world appears to us as it ought not to be and the world as it ought to be does not exist it is a condition of tension as a disproportion between what we want or need and how the world appears to operate when we find out that the world does not possess the thing we want or need but long since believed it to have we found ourselves in a crisis there are no higher truths that man can discover about life in the face of such uncertainty there is no basis for morality or justification for acting one way as opposed to another everything is permitted is not an outburst of relief or of joy but rather a bitter acknowledgement of a fact a person gains freedom in a very concrete sense no longer bound by hope for a better future or eternity without a need to pursue life's purpose or to create meaning this explains all that the unreasonable world the absurd arises out of the fundamental disharmony between the individual search for meaning and the meaninglessness of the universe mm-hmm.